Good day, it's Pete here, and I am back for another weekly France tournament back in Melbourne, and uh, we will jump straight in, see how we can go. Uh, still trying to earn some money for the bushfire relief. So if I score a top or shared top with one person, hundred bucks to the bushfire relief, I'll po uh, post a link down below uh, if you want to uh, donate. Anyway, uh, let's get in, see what we can do. So here we have uh, 10, 12 high card points, 3622, pass pass to me. Uh, looks like a pretty easy one heart opening. Uh, my partner being a past hand, I could consider something like two hearts. Because um, I'm not that interested in game unless we've got a good fit. Might keep the opponents out. I think I like it. I think I'll, I'll do it. Might make it a bit harder for the opponents to try and declare it. It will, like, if I opened a heart and my partner bid a no trump, I'd bid two hearts. Um, here, it looks like we have a heart loser two spade losers, a two club losers, and a diamond loser. So, hmm, okay. Uh, so, pass, pass to me. My partner's got 10 points opposite my 12. So, there's 18 points missing, and this is a best hand tournament. So, uh, it could be like 9 and 9, 10 and 8, 11 and 7, 12 and 6. Okay, um, looks like the ace of spades is on side. I could take a diamond finesse. I can take a heart finesse. I can lead a club up. Um, so lots of different options here. Um, if the diamond finesse works, I might be able to get rid of two clubs. Um, if the, well, we're, we're gonna let this run around to my ace first. No, uh, the east's ace. They didn't wanna take it. It uh, looks like I just want to shoot the diamond through first. If I play like heart to the king, heart finesse, and that loses, you can go like spade, spade to ace, club through, and I might not be able to get rid of my clubs. So I'm worried about getting rid of these immediate club losers. So we'll take a diamond finesse. And that's offside. So we've got a club guess now. I have to guess whether east has... Uh, the ace of clubs or the queen of clubs. It doesn't look like they've got either. Um, but I think east has shown up with king of diamonds and the ace of spades, which is seven points. If they had the ace of clubs, they sometimes would have opened the bidding. So it looks like I should play them from the queen. Um, but I really think both of those are offside. So I'll play low. See what happens. I potentially should have try, tried the uh, king on the assumption that they gave me a choice I didn't deserve. Um, okay, so West has shown up with queen, jack of spades, ace, queen of diamonds. Is... No, not diamonds. Queen, jack of spades, ace, queen of clubs. It's nine points. I still don't know who's got the... Uh, um, queen of hearts. Okay, so playing heart to the king, it looks like we just want to take a, a heart finesse here. No. Okay, so I've still got two more heart losers. Um, there's not a lot I can do about that. Um, so, down two, 92%, so, uh, opening two hearts worked, I guess, uh, almost a shared top, but it was shared with, uh, one other person who got out in three no trumps, they opened one no trump, but, uh, if you open one heart and bid two hearts, your partner invites, and the hand just goes haywire, so, here my whole, uh, reasoning for two hearts, so, First of all, in third seat, I wasn't that interested in game. I've just got like this flat 12 count. It's really hard for me to think that part we would want to bid and make game. The times that we would want to bid and make game is when partners got four card support. And they're, they're going to jump raise hearts anyway, or do something along those lines. 
So I would still get to game whenever we've got a big fit in hearts. But it stops partner inviting on uh, these sorts of hands. So 92% solid way to uh, kick this off. And we'll move on to board number two. Here we've got 10, 21 high card points. By the way, like every single finesse... Oh, no. I was thinking every single finesse, but the spade finesse worked. So it could have been more disastrous, but it would have been very hard for the opponents to get more tricks than that. Um, that layout was about as bad as it could have been. Anyway, 21 balanced, nice easy 2-no trump opening, and 3-no trump from my partner. So pass, 2-no, pass, 3-no. Or pass. So it looks like we've got four club tricks and a heart is five, two diamonds is seven. I can build two spade tricks for nine. Possible extra tricks are diamonds could be three, three. Um, a king, queen of hearts could be on side. That's about it. I don't want to duck the diamond. Uh, it would give me an extra chance if diamonds are three, three. Um, for me to get an extra trick, but I'm really worried about hearts. If I duck this, they might play a heart to a honor spade, they win, and then I might even go down. Hey, May Jester, thanks for coming in. Okay, Jack of Diamonds to the Queen, still missing the 10, 9, and 7. There's not a lot I can do there, but we'll win and shift to a spade. Um, I feel like uh, ducking here is fine. Okay, and they, they just uh, continue there. Okay, so at this stage, um, I can throw two hearts away. Uh, I really don't see any extra chances of taking all the tricks. So, three spades, four clubs, two diamonds, and a heart. Looks like ten tricks. Um, I could run all my stuff and see if I could play a heart to the jack, but that's just not going to happen. So, yeah. Plus one, probably a flat board. 57%, that is, uh, that's a generous 57%. Uh, some pe one person didn't make it, one went down too. Just a quick, hi, I'm off to bed. Good luck with the weekly free. We'll watch later. Thanks. Thanks for popping in. Uh, board number three. Uh, 10, 21 highs, flat hand, four triple three. Another two no trump opening. Ah, oh, joys. My favorite contract. Not really. This two no is like just abysmal to try and uh, play in. Um, 10 of spades lead. So it could be from like ace, queen, 10, nine. Uh, if it's from, yeah, so uh, I want to hop jack in case it's from ace, queen, 10, nine, but pretty unlikely for that to work. Well, I got to win that. It looks like I got two clubs. I might be able to build some amount of diamond tricks and some heart tricks, but this looks like disaster control. Just play a top diamond and they took the ace. All right. Ace of spades. Okay. Uh, so three spades in my hand, two, two, three, six. So I'm gonna lose five spades, a diamond is six, a heart is seven. Uh, right. So I need to find three discards and in my hand that's two hearts and a club. In dummy, that's three hearts. I just want to have my uh, diamond discard. They might um, not find the correct defense here. Um, if I go ace, king of clubs and I drop the queen, I have a chance. Sixty percent, <laughs> two no down two. Uh, some went down three, some went down four, but uh, 
Not the most exciting hand there. I am surprised that no one just did something really weird and not open it. Um, but, yeah. Still running well. About at 70%. So, here. 5517 count. Diamond pass a heart. Um, I don't want to double and then bid clubs. I'm just going to get in there and bid clubs straight away. Support double two hearts. All right. I, I feel like I've got good defense to this. Um, double is a takeout double, so I'll just pass. Three diamonds. I don't want to hear that. Um, so... West has six diamonds and an invite with, uh, so they got a 4-3 heart fit. So my partner's got a singleton heart. Um, I've got 17. West is pretty strong as well. They've probably got like 16. Like they've got an invite. They might have 17 as well. So that's 16, 16, uh, 17 and 16 is, uh, 33. East has pretty much all the remaining points. So my partner's got like a Yabra there. Um, how will three diamonds go? How will other contracts go? So I've got three heart losers and two spade losers, I've, which is five losers if we bid to four clubs. Um, probably might get tapped out, but it might be awkward for them. I might get out for down one in four clubs some of the time. I think that, like, my partner's got one heart or no hearts. They might have, like, a huge stack of spades, but other than that, um, they should have some club support for me. Um, so if they've got, say, four diamonds, four or five diamonds, are we going to beat this by, like, ace of clubs, they rough, well, like ace king of clubs and they rough. Uh, I think I'll pass, but like four clubs could be right. Um, but I think minus 200 is a little bit too scary. Okay, uh, so I'll put the king on that. So six, eight points in dummy. So eight points in the dummy opposite my 17 is 25 there's 15 points left west is invitational but it looks like their fair chances to have like void club or something i don't need all of my hearts the spade's not going anywhere okay so i could give my partner a, a rough or I could try and tap them. Uh, so if I give my partner a rough and it goes club to me and another rough, I don't think another club's standing up. And then I think that uh, I'm just roughing West's heart loser. So we'll go for just trying to tap them. There's the diamond shortage, club shortage. Forty-six percent. Three diamonds plus two. Is there anything we could have done about that? So they're cold plus two. Some people got to. Ah, uh, so some people passed throughout, and the opponents get to three no trumps if you do that. So you can pass, and then you can smash three no trumps. I really didn't think that they were going to get to uh, three no trumps like that. Um, someone bid two clubs and did come back in with four clubs, which was just down one, but you get doubled in that. Oh, wow, you're cold for four clubs. Okay, so how do we have to play four clubs? So, um, what do they do? So they start with a diamond and you trump. Uh... And now I think it's probably just heart. Yeah, just exit a low heart. Play west for ace third heart. 
So if you're rough two hearts, you're probably in good stead. I feel like they might have drawn a trump. Um, and now, especially a low club to the 10, when they force you to keep rough wing with the king, queen, jack, that looks like you're getting into some serious trouble there. Um, but four clubs seem to be a reasonable shot. Uh, passing throughout, I didn't consider, um, but it worked. Um, pass, pass to me, flat 12 count. I'll start with one heart, double two hearts, three diamonds. You want an extra trump here to try and compete. So my partner's probably got four hearts for this sort of bid. Yeah, so my partner's got four hearts and a decent hand. We get the king of clubs lead. And I have two diamond losers. I can trump one of them. I have a spade loser. I can take a spade finesse. And I've got three club losers. I can play for the jack of clubs to be with east. Or I could double finesse spades. And if the king and jack are on side, I might be able to get rid of both my diamonds. Um, so pass, pass. Um, and it's gone double, one heart double. Two hearts, three diamonds. So my partner's got nine opposite my 12, 21, so 19 missing. Um, East diamonds are probably five, three. Nine of diamonds to the jack. Looks like West probably doesn't have that good of diamonds. Okay, so. Um, heart to the king. Heart back. Okay, so here's the crunch point. Do I want to double finesse spades? So I can always trump my diamond. Um, so I lose one diamond and two clubs here. If I finesse the spade deep and it loses to the jack, I lose jack, a diamond, and two clubs, which seems too much. West might have, like if West had king, jack, eight, fourth or king jack eight of spades and they might have done something weird when i lead the nine here so we'll just hop queen mm. it's offside we're playing west to not have the jack preserve the beer card just for good measure and looks like we're down one 57 percent uh so Pretty standard one. Someone got out for making three. So here, I do know there's a best hand tournament, an ace queen. So I know West has ace king, maybe the jack of clubs for eight. Uh, it's weird on mine when it went nine of diamonds to the jack, because it looks like East doesn't have the ten of diamonds. So I don't really know if East has king, queen, jack of diamonds, or West has led from some weird holding, but um, how'd they proceed from here? Ah, okay, that'll, that'll do it. Anyway, <laughs> I've, uh, I thought I'd gone down a lot, but 150, that just made a couple of over, over tricks. But lots of negatives here, which is usually bad in a uh, best hand tournament, but so far, tracking at 62%. Moving on to board number six, and it's gone one club on my right, and we've got 12, uh, 14 points. To me, this just looks like a takeout double. Uh, I prefer that over a diamond. Brings my partner, gives my partner a fair few different options. Don't have anything more, but here we are in two spades on a diamond lead. Okay, so we have a diamond fit, but two spades could play uh, reasonably well. I'm not too worried about the opponents um, being able to rough a diamond or anything. That'll help me get trump control back. But we've got 6, 10 opposite, uh, what did I say? Uh, 8, 12, 14. So 24, 16 missing. East is probably 12 to 14 balance. So I think West has 2 to 4 points. None of which are in diamonds. Okay, so it just looks like I want to start drawing trumps quickly so they don't get too many roughs. Um, East, if they had ace, queen, third spade, might hop up with the ace. Uh, so I, there's some consideration to playing 
like spade to the king, but I don't really see it. So lose to the queen? No. It holds. Um, I think I just want to continue drawing trumps at this stage. Uh, like, if I could get to the north end and lead another spade up, that would only be useful if East had ace, queen, third spade, and not a singleton diamond. The diamond lead probably does suggest they actually had a singleton there. So East could have unbalanced as well. Um, but West still has at least two points. I don't know whether it's the king of clubs, which East might lead ace of clubs from ace king. Or otherwise, it's the king of hearts. Um, so let's just swing the king of spades, give them their spade tricks, but try and draw trumps uh, quickly. Okay, their spades are 4 2. Get the two of hearts there. Okay, so club to the king, so the heart finesse is working. And so is the diamonds. Ah. Just wondering if... No, the ten of diamonds is still out. Um, I was wondering if I could get the beer card or anything. Um, here I can just... Uh, yeah, just discard and no finesse is required, but the heart, heart finesse was working. Plus one, 89%. Um, one person bid three no. So went one club, they overcalled a diamond, it goes two clubs from partner, they bid two no, and partner raises that to three no. That is a big brave two no bid. Um, but yeah, here with the takeout double, even playing the four three spade fit, played just fine. Um, I might have been able to make an extra trick. Now, nah, plus one's the best that I, I can do. Oh yeah, ace queen, fourth spade. But uh, at match points, with like 3-3, three, 5-2, three, if it was a 5-card major, I'd bid it, but 5-card minor, I'm happy to make a takeout double there. And, yeah. Back up to 67%. Two boards to play. We've got uh, 12, 16 points, balanced hand. One no trump, three no. Okay, let's see if we can get our third positive. We get a heart lead. It looks like we're going to get our third positive here. Um... We've got three clubs, three spades. I can build four diamond tricks or um, a couple of heart tricks. So it looks like 11 pretty easy tricks. Don't see any great way for making 12. Um, so, right. I could throw something away on the third spade. So. Um, if I can sneak two diamonds through, um, then maybe I could squeeze someone in diamonds and clubs. So I think diamond to the king. Okay. <laughs> I'm not going to sneak uh, two diamonds through. Maybe they'll do it if I block up the diamond suit. Uh, we'll win here and then just claim our 11 tricks for probably a flat board. 53%. Oh, whoops, sorry. Uh, <laughs> didn't click off that one. Uh, here, here was board number seven. It wasn't the most exciting uh, hand. Sorry about uh, that. Um, but, uh, yeah. We had um, two aces to lose. Our diamonds were solid. I just had a normal one no trump opening. Went heart to the ace. Heart back, cash played to block up the diamonds just in case they were ducked twice, but uh, they didn't. Um, and then I had the rest. I can throw my club. Like I've still got the eight of diamonds. I had so many tricks, just missing uh, two aces there. Uh, but uh, onto the final board, and uh, this looks like maybe we can make a grand slam or something. Um, I need to work out how I can ask partner how good their spades are. So what is five spades? What is five no trumps? 
Grand Slam Force. Spade, Trump, 3 plus. 24 plus total points. I don't know if that's asking partner how good their spades are, but if partner's got ace, king, queen, I want to be in 7. I don't care about diamonds. I think this is just... like I'm not totally sure on how the robots play this, but basically if partner's got ace, king, queen of spades, or even like ace, king to 6 spades, I want to be in grand slam. So we'll bid 5 no trumps. And we didn't get doubled. Uh, so, um, I have three diamond losers. I can ditch one and I can set up hearts. So I don't think spades are four nil. So we'll just trump that. Lead a spade. They're not. Um, so if hearts are five nil and I draw trumps, Actually, it's just safe to uh, trump another diamond. Trump another diamond, and then the final diamond uh, goes on the third heart. Okay, uh, that was 13 tricks. 96%. And my first equal top. We have a shared top. Uh, so that's $100 to uh, the Bushfire Appeal. Um, so thanks all for watching hope you enjoyed it sorry about the second last board but luckily it wasn't the most exciting one finished in rank one with 69 percent but uh tricky one to try and bid the, the grand slam there um other people only uh just can't see how they they bid it they might have just bid six spades maybe just four spades but here i think five no says partner how many of the top three spade honors do you have do you have all of them and when they did, uh, it was an, they could bid Grand Slam. And basically, we just needed hearts not 5-0, um, clubs not 7-0, or spades not 4-0. Um, so pretty good Grand Slam. Really didn't need much. And here, I was just visualizing what did I need from partner, and I just needed them not to actually have a spade loser. Um, so managed to bid a Grand Slam in a preemptive auction with the robot. So I'm pretty stoked about that one. Uh, that was this week's weekly free instant tournament. Pretty cool one. Board one started off by preempting a little bit heavy, um, which stopped my partner inviting. Uh, board two, uh, just a pretty normal two no trumps and managed to get an over trick for just a slight above average. Board two, normal two no trumps, which just uh, went pretty woefully. Uh, board four, this is my only one that was below 50%. Um, some people passed throughout and the opponents got to three no trumps. That one, that didn't really occur to me. Um, had a good good club suit. Luckily, I didn't bid four clubs, which happens to get doubled, but you are cold. Tricky one to play, so maybe I would have liked that. Um, anyway, uh, then board five, three hearts, down one. Um, so here, just on the spade finesse. Really, when you're preempt, uh, uh, competing at the three level, you want the extra trump. We had the nine card heart fit, so that seemed good. The opponents would lose two hearts and two spades. That's it. They make their three diamonds, so minus 100 is a good score in comparison. Then board six, I made the takeout double uh, rather than overcalling my diamonds. I thought I would bring partner into the, uh, the auction a bit more. A lot easier for them to bid their five card mages, and if you've got a four three fit, that's fine anyway. And then uh, a dull one that I didn't even show you, you the play. Um, sorry about that, but uh, yeah, just missing your two aces. And then finally got to finish it off with the Grand Slam uh, with the shared top. So uh, big shout out to all my Patreon supporters because without them, I wouldn't be able to make this content. Um, so if you like what I do, uh, please check out my Patreon and consider supporting. I'm closing in on the 100 patron mark, which will allow me to uh, open up, well, restart one of my old set, uh, I guess, videos called uh, Triple Dummy, which was just sort of like a talk show sort of thing. Um, so if you are considering it, now's a good time to try and do it. Thanks all for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.